I don't understand. I have to say, like, I'm not one for diva worship. I don't, you know, I'm going to be crucified, if, ugh, but I don't get Beyonce. I, even more so, I don't get that other moron who covers her face in tinfoil and wears meat. I just, I don't... <laughs> I know, you hear the way the... I, I feel the gay, like, <laughs> uncomfortable, spine-tingling silence. Where's she, where's she going with this Miss thing? Like, I feel it. <laughs> I don't give a shit about Lady Gaga. Like, I, I grew up playing guitar and playing the Ramones and Jimi Hendrix and the Runaways. Like, I love rock and roll. But um, now I, I feel like I've become a cultural stereotype because I found my gay diva. It's, um... <laughs> It's the Barefoot Contessa on the Food Network. I know, I know. Man, I want to be friends with Ina Garten so badly. She's this, like, pleasantly chubby little Jewish lady with a McMansion in East Hampton. She has a huge gay following. And she is completely disconnected from reality because she's so fucking loaded. Today we're going to make lemon bars. <laughs> I have about half a cup of lemon juice. If you don't have lemon juice, don't worry about it. You can use some vodka or liquefied molly. <laughs> and no one will know the difference. <laughs> so I'm going to turn up the volume on this lobster bisque. My friend Anna's coming over. Her family owns the Atlantic Ocean. <laughs> Michael and Miguel are coming over. They're going to help my husband, Jeffrey, come out of the claws. <laughs> Won't Jeffrey be surprised to see that we're not having roast chicken again? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, they're doing the children's chopped now. Oh, they put the kids in the... I feel so bad. They cry, and there's always, like, a little fat, rich one. And they're, like, they're like denim... What are you going to do if you win the prize money? <laughs> if I win the prize money, I want to go back to Paris again for the second time <laughs> and study with the chef de cuisine at the Fleur de la Fleur de la Fleur de la <laughs> And they're like, un, un deep, what are you going to do with the prize money? <laughs> if I win the prize money, I want to buy my family a mule. so I can ride my mother to the village and get her teeth. 